Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to Soling the Ark. I'm Flinger Foo, and uh, we're making a bunch of. Uh, wrong button. Oh, uh, so touchy. All right, uh, we are making a bunch of nets. Uh, I think we've got it nailed on the fiber just a bit. This guy is absolutely amazing for gathering up just. Oh, look at all the narco berries. Uh, all right, let's unload this stuff. All right, caramel latte, I need you to hold this. Um, but yeah, today we are do definitely going on it. Uh, that's where I left my long neck. Thank you for holding on to that, caramel latte. I appreciate that. Uh, yeah, we are definitely going on a taming spree. I want to go see a whole bunch of stuff that we can net. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh! Nailed it. I want to see... Go, just go get a whole bunch of stuff that we can net. And get it tamed, everything like that. Which spoiled... Oh, we have no spoiled meat in here. <laughs> well, yeah, we'll get some eventually. But yeah, um, that's the mission today. I want to get as many nets going as possible. Uh, Karen's over here just chilling out. I've been leveling her up. We're waiting on her little poor addiction to go away so where I can actually uh, carry her out. You know what? You can come with me anyway, right? We just won't transform you. Yeah, exactly, Karen. I hear you up there. I know. You're being all cute and stuff. See, this is what you do. You're all cute until I give you an element and then it's, rawr, eat face. Right. And that's just how it works. Grab some of this because it uses a ton. All right, let's get the uh, organic palmer. We might need to go duck hunting again, but we're going to use what we've got. Um, and there's a bunch of ducks just right down below me, too. I actually saw them when I was editing uh, uh, the video where I went duck hunting, and uh, there was a whole bunch right at the very beginning where I was like, hey, there was ducks right there. Why did I keep going? But that's usually the way it works. Uh, let's see. Thirty-three. All right. All right. Got that all repaired up. We've got nine left. All right. That works for me. All right. So we've got forty-seven. Let's go see what kind of damage we can get into. I'm thinking I. Oh, purple drop right next to base. Yes, please. I'm thinking I definitely want a Quetzal. Oh, this is... what? How are we going to get this? Oh, right there. <gasps> Ooh, another tech bow. I love tech... Oh, and this one's got high durability. Wow. Less damage, high durability. Yoink. Thank you. All right, that one's good. That was a good bow. throw this one down over inside of here since we're right next to base. And I've noticed, though, that if you're looking for tech bows and stuff, um, the purple drops is probably the best one for it. Uh, I mean, that's not absolutely guaranteed, but I've had the best luck out of purple drops. So far, between the, um, playing on solo and then also playing on uh, my Patreon servers, I think I've looted at least 10 bows out of purple drops. So, yeah, I think purple is just the best. All right, so, uh, oh, 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 no, never mind. We already have our strider. I was going to say, we have to grab the stuff for our strider just in case, but no. Um, we're going to need... I know there's Quetzals all the way over here. Also, I want to go over to the uh, dark side over there because also I'm going to start looking into shadow mains. And I already um, have a good idea about a taming pen for shadow mains. And a good source, but we also need to go get a bunch of fungal wood. Also, I want to get an Argent just for um, the sake of having an Argent. Maybe a couple Snow Owls because um, I want to get crops going. And Snow Owl Vomit is probably one of the best uh, sources. And you know what? I'm going the wrong direction. If we're looking for Argents, we need to go over on the south side. All right. Yeah, Argents and... What, where, yeah, Argents and owls usually frequent just right over there. So yeah, let's get our, let's get our butt over there. And let's go looking. Let's go net some stuff. Another purple drop. I'll 
take that. I'll take that. Nah, nah. I need to get a grinder. Need to get a grind. Oh, alpha. Oh, and one thing I love about these nets here, watch. perfectly line up headshots on alphas. Look at that. That's amazing. Yeah. We can have all the prime meat we want, and we can also level up our bob in the process. Alright, let's get looking for Argents and stuff. Now, there's a spot back here where you can get snow owls and Argents, kind of galore. Kind of impressed though on these. See if we can take down the Alpha Carno. Raptor, so we gotta stay. Okay. That's an Got artificial me. sun out there keeping everything alive in here. I guess that control fusion is powering this starship too. Can't get a headshot, his head's in the ground. Probably should have grabbed Caramelante. on my bow. There he goes! Wow. That's <laughs> so good. Oh, man. This map is so high-powered. This is great. Alright, this spot back here, this is a gold mine for owls, thylos. Argents. I saw a 145 owl, but it got eaten right in front of me. It was unfortunate. Also, 140 Thyla over here. I'm around here. A little white one with red paws. Things over in this little bit. Also, there's tons of aloes over here. R wrong button. There's the thyla. Oh, there's the thyla. At 140 female. Actually, a good thyla. I love these uh, new direwolves. Some of them straight up just look like African wild dogs. They are so cool looking. Oh, and then this cave right here. Right over here, there's a cave that goes all the way behind this waterfall. And then there's a spot right here. Pretty cool. And this is right here on the map. This is a great spot for a base. If you want to be like wicked hidden, it just goes right through just like this. All the way around to the other side. That is so cool. You could easily... Uh, Lock that off with the uh, behemoth dino gates. Very, very cool spot. Oh, hey, remember when we were talking about fertilizer? Yep, that just happened. That's a good loot drop. I think I found it. It's not the R flavor. The R flavors are only over on the other side, but this one right here. That one.
All right, let's see if we can net him so where he lands right on top of this. Come on. There we go. All right, now to go get some mutton. Actually, I'm gonna let him starve out for a little bit. Do I have narcotics on me? I do, I've got 100. So I'm gonna let him uh, get down nice and comfy. And then we're going to uh, starve him out a little bit. But yeah, this is actually a really, really good spot for it. Right up here on the land bridge. Yeah. Being able to net Quetzals. <laughs> Forget about it. Super easy. And another tech bow. And a vault. Holy crap. I'll take that. That out. That out. That out. And some of these loot drops are very deceptive. You go and you loot it, and uh, it has 50 irrigation pipes, which definitely over encumber you. And then there's a Carno running up on your butt, and you're like going, Oh no, please. No touchy. And yeah, and then it's like, oh, be going to touch, and then it eats you. Yeah, it's great. Alright. Still waiting on this guy's Torpor to come down. What are you at? You're still really high. All right, but yeah, I'm going to go get mutton, throw it on him, and then get a saddle. Ooh. More owls. Something down there. Oh, 150 aloe. Okay, well, nice knowing you, owls. Get a little bit lower. Well, hey, that'll work. But it's fighting Demorphodons. Hmm. Let me get those Demorphodons off. This could go bad very quickly. Moving target, attacking moving target. I need instant hit. Oh, he killed it! Here, dude. Yeah, come on. Get you over here. Somewhere up here. All I'm doing is pressing H. And there it goes. Now it's out. All right. So now we can just track this guy. And when we get mutton, we'll bring over some extra. That's really effective. And what? Mail. Okay. And loot drop. Yay. <laughs> and the server just keeps on giving. Oh, this is great. Hey, industrial cooker. Thank you. See what I mean? 50 irrigation pipes.
That's just good luck right there. Oh, my Quetzal fell through the ground. Okay, is this safe enough down here? Yeah, I think it is. How are you doing? Alright, I'm gonna put some narcotics on you. Alright, so we've got... 100 narcotics on it. Got a good enough stamina, and that's what we want. We want super high stamina. Uh, weight? Yeah, weight's okay, um, especially when it comes to Quetzals, but I'm more worried about stamina. Um, this guy right here is going to absolutely be a long flyer, and since they're super slow, yeah. So I want to level him up in nothing but stamina. Oh, hey, an otter. Hmm, cool. All right, so now, time to go get some... Well, what's your food stat at right now? Hmm. Throwing mutton on you would probably be a little bit too early. I'm going to get you out of render range. I'm not going to kill anything around this area. Because I don't want any raptors to spawn. All right. Go get some mutton. I need to put away all this loot that I got. And mutton is best found over here in the city. It's just super easy. And there's our base. Eh, that'll work. It fits, kind of. Derogated. That's all that matters, right? These raptors and this uh, enforcer were over here. And they were nice enough to just give me a whole bunch of mutton. It was great. I think that'll be good. Oh my god. The mother of all tech bows. Yes, please. Oh, hey, Snow Owls. How did you know? That was a good loot drop. And that was a good tech bow. So, sitting here, waiting on this bird to finish up. I've already got the owl. Uh, the owl actually turned out to be not too bad. 319 melee damage. Not bad at all. Um, yeah. Stamina's a little low, but that's not a bad thing at all. Uh, a little bit of leveling. Uh, with melee damage like that, we could actually breed it. But, take a look at this new bow. This thing is kind of insane. Right, show me your headshot. Probably should have picked a fight with something different. Where it didn't have the armor buff. Alright, where's something that doesn't have armor? Hmm? Oh, hi, ducks. Whoa! <laughs> That's a nice hitter! Holy! Oh. If only I could hit a duck. Stand still, don't move. Oh, hi. Yeah. That's a good one. That, I'd love this bow. Absolutely love this bow. Tech bows are amazing. Oh, hey, there we go. So we have our first Quetzal of the season. Aim Flappy Bird. Oh, no, please. Land. Thank you. All right, let's get you in. We gotta go get a saddle on you. All right, let's get Flappy Bird out here. There you go. Take your big poop. Let's see, um, and I've just been throwing in here. No, it's a oh, wrong button. Face plant against the uh, fabricator. I've just been throwing all my tech bows in here. So far, I've got three of them. Pretty good ones, too. <laughs> the, uh... Futsal Saddle. Bending Paste, Fiber Hide, Silica Pearls. We've got all that. The... Okay. 
There we go. Butzel saddle in the making. Come on, gimme. Right there. Sweet. Oh, no, not quite a saddle in there. Alright, now... We need to pop you back in our pocket. Flappy bird. We're going grinding. Because we... Uh, we're getting ready for shadow main, so we need... Fish baskets. So that takes 60 fungal wood each. So I'm just going to go over and harvest up a bunch of stuff. So we need to take a butt ton of fiber. And a butt ton of thatch. Let's get... Let's get right below encumbering ourselves on this. And then we'll go... Harvest up. Shames me to have to do this. We'll go harvest up. A whole bunch of fungal wood, which means dude, get out of the range of Polyticus. Yeah, <laughs> holy crap, thirteen thousand fiber. Right below encumbered. There we go. Now we head over to the other section. Woo! It's always eerie coming out here. I mean, it's not super bad, but... Until you meet a, meet a void one. And then it's super bad. Now, this is the first time I've been on this side on this server. So, anything can happen. And right here, this is fungal wood. Whoa, 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 whoa. And keep my eye peeled from Noglins. And these guys. Come on. There we go. Ooh, glow tail. Go find a nice spot to. What level is that glow tail? 85. Go find a nice place to farm up a bunch of fungal wood. For shadow mains and stuff. Should be good. And this place isn't nearly as bad. I mean, right here in the beginning, 
as some other spots. Some other spots you land, you're dead. Other than that, I mean, uh, this spot right here, not bad at all. Okay, this should be pretty good. That's what I'm talking about. Let's we'll craft up a whole ton. All right, so we've got 10, 20, 30, 40, 53 baskets. All right, that should work for now. Let's get back over. Now, I fully intend on exploring the crap out of this. Not today. There's so much here. I mean, there's an entire biome. That is just as massive as the one we've been sailing around on for a while. This, this area over here is amazingly cool. We need to get... And this spot right here is... The only spot where a bunch of the R flavored stuff spawns. So we totally need to uh, get our butt over here and do a ton of stuff. Today, we're getting fish. A whole bunch of fish. We're filling up our lake with fish because apparently we like fish. All right, let's get down in the water. Oh, hey, an otter. All right, and I want. Either salmon or piranha. I don't think I want the uh, coelacanths. Because I want to for science the crap out of this between the... Well, maybe I should get a couple coelacanths. Probably not too many. What's your size? Oh, you're, you're good size. Back over here. Wrong button. Okay, where are you? Come here! There you are. You're a big one. Okay. Let's go to a smaller area. Where the fish can't wander too much. Alright, got some piranhas inbound. You? Oh, he broke my trap, you jerk. Come on. Oh, no. You're a jerk. You're a real jerk, Mr. Piranha. Come on. I hate you. <laughs> I really hate you. You're not a nice fish. Right, let's get over here in this. This is gonna be our pond. That's our fish so far. And we're gonna be filling up this pond so where we've got plenty of uh, fish everywhere. And 
these little rivers over here, they're actually kind of good. Um, you can find little pockets that... Wrong button. You can find little pockets of uh, water that are just stuffed with fish and they can't even move. And it's great. All right. So, oh, where'd the rest of them? Oh, they're all piled on top of each other. My piranha go pick a fight. Is that what happened? Oh, no, there he is. Okay. Uh, I'm stuck inside my salmon. Yeah, these things, they have a spoil time, so... It's just better that I use double the traps instead of worrying about them spoiling this way here when we finally start to go grab a shadow main, we'll have fish on hand ready to go. Now I can just come out like this and I can just re-trap them whenever I want. See, just right like that. I'll just pick that up for now. Alright! Ooh, okay, so we got the Quetzal, we've got uh, our owl, which was kind of just a byproduct uh, product of it, but yeah, also we've got our fish. So yeah! All right, and this thing drives me nuts if it goes on too long. All right, so hey. Anyway, hey, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm Next video, we're jumping into Shadow Mains. We're going to see what we can do. So hey, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you click that like button. I really appreciate it. If you're new around here, subscribe. And until next time, this is Flickr Foo, and take it easy, everybody.